Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. I got another game that was never played for you. We're going to use the Imagine set again. And we are going the Imagined um, Stratomatic Baseball set for 2020. And we are going to do a, let's see. We are going to do a, um, an unscheduled game between the San Francisco Giants. Let's get the Imagine set up. And um, we're going to be home. I think that I'll have the Giants be home. So we're going to do a game between the Giants and the New York Mets. So the New York Mets will be visiting... They'll be the computer. We will be at home. Run by the human. And let's see. We'll have this be a May game. Day game, because I love day games. And again, we're going to have to change this to the computer. He's going to have DeGrom, and I'm not going to say we're not going up against DeGrom. I mean, come on. Let's go up against... Um, let's see here. Waka. Waka was very, very bad. Porcello was bad. We'll go up against this Peterson guy. He was not too terrible, so... And we've got Tyler Anderson going, which I'm happy enough with um, to have that be the situation. Um, let me go down here and turn down the sound. And I guess we are now ready to play ball. And let me move myself down somewhere where I'm kind of out of the way. And uh, let's see. And let's bring this down a little bit. So you can see who's up. And I think that that is the perfect place to put it. So... Here we are, we're ready to go. Uh, San Francisco playing New York. The game that never was, because as we all know, the East did not, the East only played Eastern teams. The Central teams only played Central teams. And the Western teams only played Western teams. So, Jay Davis is up with two down, and it looks like he's doubling down the line. And he does, and Conforto is up. And he hits one through the gap, but the runner doesn't score, and now Alfonso is up. Pete Alfonso. And did he go deep? I was saying to myself, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't pitch to this guy. But no, that was a deep fly ball. So, all right. Two down, and uh, Dominic Smith up. Now, the computer made both of these um, lineups, so, so I am, uh, you know, it's not like I got an unfair advantage because I was making a lineup. I don't know. I mean, there's nothing to say that my lineup would be any better than a computer's anyway, so. But the computer did make the lineups for both teams, and I just verified the Giants pitcher and um, changed the Mets pitcher, because he had his, like, all-world A skull. So we've got Wilmer Flores up with two on and one down. And uh, is that going to fall? Fall? Yes, it does. So we tie the game at one. And here's Evan Longoria. And Evan Longoria might be going shopping at the Gap or just going over the wall. 
No, it was caught. So it's a deep fly ball, but it does get a run in. And now uh, Darren Ruff is up. And that's it, looks like. So, yeah, we're going back in the field. And Wilson Ramos is up against Tyler Anderson. And, I, and you know what? I've been thinking. I've been looking at this Imagine set, and I'm thinking what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a White Sox Imagine season. And it's really interesting. I, I checked the schedule that they put in the game for the Imagine season, and it was the schedule that would have been if they had played 162 games. The White Sox play the NL West instead of playing the um, – NL Central, as they did, and as they will again in 2021. So that was interesting, I thought, that they had the um, actual schedule that would have been. And uh, Joey Bart is leading off for us here in the bottom of the second. We have a 2-1 to one lead, and Bart is out. So I'm thinking I'm going to try to do a White Sox season, do the White Sox imagine season, because that was never played. We didn't play a lot of the teams in the American League. We didn't play any of the teams in the NL West last year. And so, you you know, it's not like, like if you take a 60-game set and you replay it and you play a 60-game schedule, you know where the White Sox finished. You know they were 35 and uh, whatever, they were, 35 and 25. And you know you can probably bank on them being about that you know that with the imagined season because the imagined season you're playing almost uh, well you're playing more than two times a greater number of games and you're playing against an array of all kinds of teams that you didn't even play so those players are good but you know how are they going to stack up when they have to play all the best teams, you know, some of the better teams in the other divisions of the American League. And, uh, you know, and not to mention the L.A. Dodgers and the San Diego Padres from the NL West. So it'll I think it'll be interesting to see. And I am so anxious to see that that I think I am going to do that. I'm going to play a uh, an imagined White Sox season. And I'm in the process right now of setting it up. And so these will serve as, uh, like, basically um, preseason games just to get a look at the imagined teams and a look at them playing against teams that they didn't play. Um, as right now we are in, I believe, the top fourth and uh, leading 2-1. Dominic Smith up again. He's 0-for-1. He goes down like on strikes. And so Wilson Ramos is up with two down. Top of the fourth, we're beating the match two to one. And that's going to be a fly ball. So we are back up. We got Wilson or Wilmer Flores up. He's going to swing away. Former Matt himself, I believe. And he hits the ball in the hole, possibly, but he's out. Longoria's up. And he's out, and Darren Ruff is up. He's going to swing away. And it looks like he's out, and he is. So here comes Robinson Cano of the Mets, top of the fifth. We're winning 2-1. to one. Game in beautiful San Francisco, and that's going to be a fly out to Yastrzemski. Thought maybe he got a hold of it, but he didn't. Ahmad Rosario, who I believe now is on the Indians. And that's going to be a fly ball, so there's two down here in the fifth for the Mets. And that brings up Brandon Nimmo. And he hits the ball right up the middle for a base hit. Jeff McNeil's up. Good hitter. And hopefully he flies out, and he does. So 
That brings Joey Bart back to the plate. Eight for one on the day, bottom of the fifth. We're still winning two to one. All the runs were scored in the first inning of the game. The Mets led off by taking a one nothing lead, and then we got two in the bottom of the first. No scoring since then, and Brandon Crawford up with an out, and he's going to ground out to Cano. And that brings up Dubon, Mauricio Dubon. And he looks like he's shopping at the gap. Or maybe a home run. No, it was an out. Are you kidding me? All right. J.D. Davis is up against our man, Tyler Anderson, who's still going strong. And that's an out. Conforto is up. And he flies out. So right now I am going to be in the process of setting up all the LCMs for all of the teams in the league. Because we're not going to go with LCMs. That's one thing we're not doing. I want the top competition to be good. And uh, Austin Slater, for us, bottom of the sixth now. And David Peterson's still out there, but why not? I mean, he's pitching pretty well, too. Salon was up with a man on and no outs. And did he walk? He did. And the Ostremski's up with no outs and runners at first and second. And now they do bring in Juris Familia to pitch to Yastrzemski. And uh, he's out, strikes out. That brings up Wilmer Flores. And Wilmer Flores is grounding possibly into a double play. No, he didn't. So it, there was an out, but it wasn't a double play. Thank you. And Longoria comes up. And he's going to hit the ball into the gap. Let's see if he gets uh, out. So we maintain the slim 2-1 to one lead. I've still got Tyler Anderson out there pitching, and now to Dominic Smith. And that's going to be another base hit up the middle. No, actually, Dominic Smith hadn't had a hit before that. So Wilson Ramos hitting it up the middle. And, uh, yeah, runners at first and second. The Mets got something going here with Robinson Cano up. And now it's real trouble. Oh, no. No, I guess uh, I thought maybe that would have been a base hit, but it wasn't. So Rosario's up with one down, runners at first and second. And that's a ground ball to Crawford, and they got an infield hit out of that. Either an error or an infield hit. So now Nimmo is up. That's going to be a, hopefully a fly. No, that's going to be a big fly is what that's going to be. Gone, and now we are losing big time, 5-2. to two. And it looks like I'm going to have to bring somebody else in. So I'm going to go to the bullpen. And we are going to get... We're going to bring in Selman. I don't even know who that guy is, but um, we're bringing him in. And he'll pitch to J.D. Davis. So now we got to come from behind. We're down by three now. Whew. And, uh, yeah, trivia question. Here's a trivia question. How did I allow the uh, San Francisco Giants to get into this hole when we were winning all the way along? All right. So uh, rough batting against Familia. We'll let him swing away. Is that over Nimmo's head? I hope it is. Uh, I'm going to say no. We're not going to try to stretch that. So, man on second with no outs and Joey Bart up. And he strikes out. 
That brings up Crawford. And he's out. And that brings up, yeah, let me, I guess I better move myself up here. Although it doesn't really matter because you can't see the rolls. I don't have it set up to show you the rolls, but you can see the cards at least. Two down, and Slater is up at the plate. And that's going to be a base hit. Hit scores at least one run. And it does score two. So now no, we're only down by a run. We got a man 90 feet away. And now he's bringing in Seth Lugo to face Donovan Solano. And that's going to be an out. So they do, we do get two runs, though. So if we can hold the line here, we have a chance, I think, because we got two more at-bats. And that's an out. And then Pete Alonzo is up with one down. And he strikes out. Oh, no, no, he didn't, but now he does. And that brings up Dominic Smith. And he's up. up. So now we've got Mike Yastrzemski up, bottom of the eighth. Got to start really playing some ball now. We're down by a run. Down by a single run. And Yastrzemski's going to fly out to Smith. That brings up Wilmer Flores. I'm going to have him swing away. And he is out, and that brings up Longoria. And Longoria may have hit it over Nemo's head. He did, and now Darren Ruff. And Darren Ruff, did you go deep? No, you didn't. You're going to fly out to Conforto. Well, we got the ninth. We do have the ninth, so we're getting a lot of work in for Sam Selman, but you know, no. all right, maybe not. Let's go get him. Um, let me see here. I don't know about that. Let's see. Peralta... Yeah, let's go get Peralta. So let's see if he can hold the line here with Cano up and a man at first and no outs. Might be a fly out. And it is Rosario up. That's going to be a ground out, hopefully in a double play. And it is. So we're out of the inning. We have now, we're going to the bottom of the ninth. And here they are bringing in Edwin Diaz. We were hoping for that. Joey barred up. Although he really wasn't that bad last year. And it pops out. So yeah, Bart at second. Now I'm going to sacrifice with, I hate doing this too. Can I just say that? I hate sacrificing, but I'm going to do it with Brandon Crawford up at plate. I am going to st I'm going to stay with the bunt, and that's a strikeout. So Dubon is up, and that's two down. And now it all is it's all up to Austin Slater. And that is going to be caught, and that's it. We lose the game 5-4. So let's get the box score on that one. Uh, Peterson goes five, allows two hits, two uh, runs, one earned. Walks two and strikes out four. Well, Tyler Anderson went six and a third, allowed seven hits. Five runs, four of them earned, walked one, struck out two, and uh, one of the hits was a homer. And it was the big, that was the big blow that 
did us in. So the Mets beat the Giants 5-4, two teams that did not even face each other last year and um, will be facing each other when I do my imagined season replay. So I hope you enjoyed that, and that's going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.